Pittsburgh at 1-2-12 uh, goes Anthony Grilly. Chicolo, Good. defensive end out of Miami. Oh, Good we're talking pick. football again? Yeah, we are. All right, Chicolo. <laughs> I got my mouth full. Why don't you talk, Mel? <laughs> I see my pumpkin pie. Can you believe it? I love it is. eating your pie. All right, Chicolo. <laughs> Good. <laughs> played, in a, played in a scheme. I don't know that it totally fit what he is. You know, set to do at the next level. He's a really talented guy. One of the top prospect, top recruits coming out of the high school level. Got to college, played for four years, was productive, but not quite as productive as his measurables and his talent. It kind of led you to believe that he would be. He's big. He's strong. He was in a standout at the East West Shrine game. He believes in his mind. Let's just put it this way. If used properly, he's going to be a much better player in the pros than he was in college. That remains to be seen, Bill. One of the great ways to scout is to watch people in the all-star games because they're playing against their peers they're playing against good players from other other programs yep. in the country he stood out what stood out speed agility disruptiveness toughness he will make it in the NFL, I believe. Well, the legend and the lineage is there. He is the third member of his family to play for the Hurricanes and be drafted. Tony, his father, a defensive tackle, fifth-round choice of the Bucks. Uh, his grandfather, Nick, was a guard at Miami and was a 15th-round selection of the Chicago Cardinals in 1953. On his football pants at high school, he wrote 3G for third generation Anthony Chiquillo and Anthony has lived up to that reputation the third member of his family to be drafted in the NFL We'll see if he sticks with the Pittsburgh Steelers. 